Stop lagging out, homeboy. Double kill. All right, man. That was close. Okay. Oh, now we can get close. Oh my gosh. Did the same guy just steal my kill again? Stop stealing my kills, man. How does the Nemesis hold up? The Mark III Nemesis on steroids because we are loading it up with upgrades to start we're going to use the high tech skin five percent extra durability we're going to start with the spirit razda and remember the cooldown on the nemesis is insanely short and has very good speed the nemesis the soren devo legendary pilot if that's how you pronounce it double nuke amplifiers and we might start with the razda and then go to the havoc um to switch it up maybe the second game and here's our nemesis. So we're going to take this thing into Champion League, push it to the limits, see how the nemesis holds up in 2022 Champion League. Here we go, Beacon Rush. Okay, we've landed here late. It's just so annoying. We dropped in we're like 30 seconds late into the game. And if you guys have not already, consider subscribing to the channel to watch robots die. Oh man, we really dropped in late here. All the beacons are already captured. We dropped 30 seconds late into the game. Somebody was probably tanking and we took their spot here. Okay, so right off the bat, you see 295,000 HP. Not too bad. What is that thing? I don't know what that is, but we're shooting him. Okay, kill. We got the kill. I have no idea what that guy was running, but let's push up this left side. Man, I like how the Spirit Razda and the High Tech Nemesis... Hold on, let's get... Double kill, nice. And this High Tech Nemesis skin... It looks like it, you know, goes well together. It looks like a whole theme. Triple kill! Whoa! We're at a triple kill already. Yeah, I'm telling you, this is a cool weapon robot skin design build. Rampage! Uh-oh, we're gonna... This Revenant just teleported into the center. Man, so they... The enemy team has the other side beacon, and we have this little town beacon... And then we're fighting over the center coliseum. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Okay, see, that siren has the Yangli pilot, so he's a shield breaker. Our shield is useless against that guy when he's using his ability. Oh, stupid lock on. Oh, can we get him? Oh. Oh, darn it. Okay, hold on. Let's be, wait for him to land. Wait for him to land. Our nuke amplifier is already up to 88. Boom! Kill! Nice, nice. Oh, we didn't get the godlike. Oh, no! Oh, this stupid siren. I'm telling you, this that siren build is a camper build. There's no two ways about it. The Razda Smuta siren or Harpy or Cremola, whatever. Those builds are camper builds because players go up in the air, shoot you, and then teleport back to their spot from before look what this guy's doing he's sitting back there waiting for his ability shooting us then teleports back to that behind cover at 500 meter range bro you're camping you're camping and he's shooting us is that the same guy he definitely is he's shooting us again what a loser that guy definitely wears a diaper when he goes to sleep oh man we just lost a ton of durability somehow how did we just we somehow just ate a ton of damage and we're at 29,000. Something hit us. I have no idea what. Uh-oh. They're coming in. They're coming in at us. We're going to heal up. Okay, we got some good health back. That siren is still shooting at us. Bro, you suck. You're using the best, most overpowered damage build in the game. You're not good. All right, hold on. Okay, we just unloaded a lot of... Oh, we got taken up, but we did unload some damage onto that luchador. Man, that kill streak not bad. We got a rampage and then another separate kill. And then that damage at the end. Kill. And now, of course, we have our Heimdall Lantern build. Triple kill. Man, this build, I have to admit, it's very fun to use. Q-tip 23. Q-tip. That guy. Like, Q-tips is in the ones you put in your ears to clean them. Like, is that... <laughs> is that, that guy's username for real? Q-tip? Oh, whoa. That's close. Titan Slayer, nice. That mirror mids... Oh, the beacon bar. I just noticed. We have drained their beacon bar. This game's over. We've won it. Nice. Okay, we got the win. That was a fast game. We got our nemesis kill streak. 
Let's see what kind of damage we did there. That one guy was annoying me so much, that Asian player. Um, but we're going to... Let's switch our Nemesis build to the Havoc for a more close-range brawling build. Let's go. Game 2, Nemesis. Here we go. Okay, we're here on Shenzhen right away. Nighttime Shenzhen. And I guess it makes sense to drop in our Nemesis first. So here we go. High-tech Nemesis coming in hot. 305,000 HP. Not too shabby. It could honestly use more. The problem, man, it's, it's just weird because... Uh-oh, hold on. Ah, my teammate died so fast over here, and now they've capped that beacon. This is risky. They have an Oroshi and an Aojun here. I'm going for that Aoi. No, what the? This guy's not even moving. Kill that guy. What? I don't know what that guy was doing, but we just smoked him. This is an Aojun. I'm hoping he doesn't have the Yang Li pilot that lets him shield break. Oh, yep, yeah, he does. Abort, 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 run! Oh, we got locked down too. Okay, now our drone shield is kicking in. Okay, he's coming down now. Stop lagging out, homeboy. Double kill. All right, man, that was close. He had a shield breaker. He had his chance to take us out, but he couldn't capitalize. All right, teammate, how do you want to do this? We got to... This... Did the same guy just drop in another Aojun? How many Aojuns is this guy running? The dead, the dead aim guy. All right, I'm seeing, uh, I'm trying to see how I want to push through here. Like I'm gonna, if I push forward, man, there's four enemies there and it's in open space. Yikes, yikes. Oh, this Kepri's coming at us, this is gonna be tough. Kepri's are always very difficult to take down. Okay, unload retribution rocket ability. Man, that was actually pretty good damage there. That was pretty solid damage there. Let's just wait for our ability again and... Oh, what? How did we not get that kill? How did we not get that kill? That was an absolute troll. Whoever stole that kill. Oh, no. So this guy's got a shield breaker on his siren. Assuming this is a siren. Okay. Oh, now we can get close. Oh my gosh. Did the same guy just steal my kill again? Stop stealing my kills, man. You're sitting like 500 meters away shooting your stupid hell weapons. We get some major rage today. Major rage. This is another... Come on, come on. Why is it... Oh, this guy's lagging out. Kill, there we go. Okay, we dealt some damage to that mender coming in there. Um, oh, it's I can't push forward here. It's like I'm just protecting this corner of the map because they have four players there. They got 96,000 HP left. Uh-oh, we got EMP. We're going to push forward. It's just about over. Yeah, see, it's it's nearly impossible to take down a Mender with his ability. Oh, we've got EMP'd again? Oh! That was a bad idea. That kind of annoys me. Now we, could, we better win this game now. Kill. We better win this game because... Oh, we got to kill with the, our double kill with the Orion there. We better win this game because a lot of stuff is cheesing me off here. There's stupid sirens on the other team. My dumb teammate that was stealing my kills. All right, here we go. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. That Luchador just frog splashed us, I think. And we're suppressed, but we're gonna keep going. Going. All of our shields are blown off our shell bot. Okay, let's capture this beacon. Man, this shell bot, it's so much fun because it's an absolute wrecking ball. Like the EMP on the whiteout drone, the actual blast of the shell bot, and the decent firepower. It's actually a lot of fun to use because you just go straight at enemies. You don't care who's where. You get in range and blast them. Okay, hold on. We're surviving here. You know, we're getting... We're almost, we almost have a four cap here. Look, those guys have pushed so far ahead that they forgot about this beacon. Actually, I want to take out this guy. Titan Slayer, nice. 
Oh, bro. Is that the Mender that killed us? Yes! Revenge! Double kill. That might have been the Mender that killed us. And then he fully healed up. We got a revenge. Ooh, let's kill this Harpy. This dead aim guy has been triple kill. Man, we've killed that dead aim guy like three times now. But that... It seems like that guy's having a bit... Every time I've tried to kill him, he's kind of lagged out. Um... Man, we had a 6v3 robot lead. Mech lead, but... Come on. Ugh, I almost got that guy. Okay, we're moving in here. We're being pretty aggressive. My team's just rolling right in, into their home beacon. Let's torch this falcon. Come on, come on. Rampage. Nice, nice. Okay, let's grab this beacon. Oh, Ares, Ares. So, as I was saying before, so the Ares and the Nemesis and the Hades... God like the Ares, Nemesis, and Hades. The they're the Greek robots, right? And the whole thing with them when they were released is no one, uh, no other robot had an unlimited invincible absorber shield. But these days, it's not worth anything because of how many shield breakers are in the game. So the whole ability is kind of ruined because of shield breakers, legendary pilots that get through those absorber shields. Beyond Godlike. Uh oh, hold on. Okay, it's, their beacon bar is getting drained, but can I survive a little bit longer here? Oh, we died, but we just fired off Orion there too. Okay, let's drop in our Heimdall, but I think this game's up. Alright, that's gonna wrap it up. So, as I was saying, I think the, the Hades is. I mean. Yeah, actually, before I forget, make sure to join our Predator Warbots Discord. Link in the description. Let's see what kind of damage we did. The Hades. Ares in Nemesis, 3.44 beacons, not too bad. They just need some kind of buff. The ability is not enough. They need more than just an absorber shield because everything breaks through an absorber shield. So Pixonic, buff them. Nemesis, it's still not bad, but until next time, peace. Uh, Cheeto Doritos.